Hey guys, what's up? It's Annie. Today I'm in New York City and I wanted to give you guys a tour of our hotel room. We're actually staying at the Courtyard by Marriott in Herald Square. Um, we've stayed here before. I think this is the third time we've stayed here. Um, and yeah, we really like this hotel. Herald Square is where, right by where the famous Macy's is in New York City. And it's a really, really close to Times Square. So it's an awesome location. I think right now we're on 35th Street and Times Square starts at like 42nd Street. So we're really, really close to it. It's just a quick walk. If you want to go to a show, you want to go to a restaurant, you want to see the splendor or the craziness that is Times Square. So that's why we really love this location and it's just a decently priced hotel um, and my mom has Marriott like rewards so we get points it's all good so yeah I just wanted to take you guys around our room take you around the hotel and maybe you'll want to stay here too like obviously I have no affiliation with this hotel so it's really just my recommendation to you guys of where to stay in New York City I haven't stayed everywhere but of the places I've stayed I really think this is a great like just low-cost or low cost for New York City um, with high benefit just because you can kind of walk to everywhere from here so yeah let's uh, check it out alright guys so this is our hotel room you walk in and you have a bathroom right here and then this is our room uh, it looks lived in because we've been living in it the last two days, but um, Yeah, so it's seen better days, but I cleaned it up a little for you guys um, But yeah, you got two double beds. They're super super comfy and the pillows are awesome uh, You can also request more pillows and they'll bring them up to you. No problem um, You have this like pigeon art right here because you know pigeon art is where it's at uh, Let's see what else we got two little lamps um, let's see, you got two drawers, um, though I never seem to use those drawers in hotel rooms. Um, then we got some more New York art, a huge window, and then a closet, a TV, there's a fridge in there, and you know, a little desk area. My mom has her suitcase on that little bench right there. Um, and then yeah, you got your safe, you got your fridge. When we got here, the safe, like, this piece was broken, so we told them. Um, so yeah, that's that. Um, you got a little trash can with recycling. Um, I love space to put stuff. Like, as you can see, my mom's purse, my purse. Um, and then these are actually the two shows we went to while we were here. We went to see the American Ballet Theater um, at Lincoln Center in the Met Opera House, which was incredible. Misty Copeland was in it. And then last night we saw the play that goes wrong, which is absolutely hysterical. I think it closes in August, but like go see it. It's so good. Um, this is a little sippy cup from the show, so you can bring wine to your seat, which, you know, wine to your seat is a great thing. Um, I think that was $15 for white wine, but what you gonna do? Um, there's a little coffee maker little coffee supplies I don't drink coffee so doesn't really intrigue me um, I didn't use any of these drawers um, usually I would use some of these but we weren't here that long um, we got here on Saturday and it's Monday now and we're about to leave the room is pretty good it has a little bit of wear and tear which we did um, tell the front desk about when we got here um, I'm not sure if someone like threw a wild party here before we came um, but they were really nice when we um, told them like our room had a little wear and tear they um, They gave us a new shower curtain because our shower curtain was a little beat up This is where I just have been keeping all of my stuff my shoes my little suitcase. All right, so here is the closet It's a pretty awesome closet. You got your full-length mirror here. So that's the only full-length mirror in the place um, and then you have some drawers down here. I haven't even looked in these. Um, but lots of storage. You got an ironing board and iron, but you know, I don't really iron anymore. Um, and then I just got some of my clothes in here. So pretty nice closet. You got another cubby up there. Lots of storage. What else can I show you guys? You got your chair. I swear this chair was black when we first got here and now it's red. I don't know if I'm just losing my mind or what's going on, but that's the thing. 
So here's the one window in our room. Um, it's a pretty awesome window, a pretty cool view. Uh, what do we have down there? So down there is 6th Avenue, Avenue of the Americas, um, and West 36th Street. So uh, the last two days there was a street fair going on on this street. So we were watching all the like food stalls and different vendors, um, but it's Monday now so it's just normal traffic as usual. But yeah, I really like this window. I think it's awesome. Awesome. Um, there's a shade that comes down um, so you can you know take away all the light at night so that's cool and then you have these little blinds too but they don't really do much but yeah and the shelf is like a total Annie shelf I love putting all my stuff on it um, but yeah that is our window uh, we're on the 12th floor we're actually room 1210 um, so yeah, pretty cool view. All right, here's the bathroom. Um, you have some really nice floors. They're cute. Uh, just your standard little sink, some Paul Mitchell products. I love this ledge that you can put your stuff on. That's all of my mom's stuff. Um, they put the towels in here. So you have your towels. And then this is the shower curtain I was mentioning that when we got here, it was all like ripped up so we just went to the front desk and I was just really nice and said hey let me show you a picture our shower curtains ripped up and they provided us with a brand new one which is great so you know awesome customer service is a shower the water pressure is the bomb I really enjoy it um, all of my stuff nice little hooks and yeah so that is our room it is really nice, really cozy. Um, if you come here on a Sunday night, it's gonna be much cheaper. Sunday night, for some reason, is like the cheapest um, night for a room. I just think because there's no shows on Mondays. So it's only like $200 on Sunday nights, whereas on any other nights, like $300 or more. So great room. I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the hotel now so you can get a feel for it, and then maybe you'll wanna stay here. So the guest laundry and the fitness center are both on the fourth floor. Here's the guest laundry. You just need your room key to get in. Pretty nice if you need to do some laundry. So here's the fitness center. Lots of machines. Every time I come in here, there's no one, so very private. You got your weights, yoga mats, things like that. And then there's a little like secret area out here that looks like it's for sunbathing or something, but I don't know, it's it's not open. So yeah, kind of strange, but maybe you can ask the front desk and they'll let you in there. But pretty awesome. So that's your fitness center. And again, to get in the fitness center, you just need your room key, so just like your hotel room. And it's open 24 hours, which is great for people like me who love to work out at random times. Well, this is the entrance to the courtyard. And it's actually interesting because there's a rooftop lounge here too. So the first elevator you'll see as you come in is for the Monarch Rooftop Lounge. And then you just go on to the second elevator which leads you to the courtyard elevators. So kind of interesting. So if you see people lined up here, they're going to the rooftop lounge. So just a little different. Um, as you walk out of the hotel, you, you see Macy's right in front of you and you see Herald Square. Oh, and you also have a subway station right there, which is pretty helpful if you're gonna take the subway. So, literally catty corner from the hotel is this little park. Um, where there's tons of tables, little places to get food, and then you have the huge Macy's right here. So lots to do. 
Uh, there's also a lot of different things around here. There's a Urban Outfitters. There's a Starbucks and a Dwayne Reed. Um, let's see what else. H&M, Sunglass Hut, Gap. I think there's a Victoria's Secret over there too. So a lot of things going on. Here's a little reading room where I guess you can borrow magazines and newspapers. It's so cute. So there's the Gap, there's the Victoria's Secret, and then we're gonna walk back to the hotel. So we just kind of did a circle. So there's the hotel. As you can see, it's on 35th Street and 6th Avenue. Um, 6th Avenue is also called Avenue of the Americas. The lobby is really nice, tons and tons of seating, some computers you can use, you can get food for breakfast, TVs you can watch, and then there's even a little market where you can get snacks throughout the day and night. And if you want to work out, I highly recommend the stairs. They are a tough climb up, <laughs> but they're available if you want them. They actually have a 13th floor, which I love. Um, you usually don't find that, they usually skip it, and it's my favorite floor, but we're on 12. 12. So when you come out of the elevator, you have this little area here, and the stairs are right there. Huge window. I'm back in Maryland, but thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know down below what you thought of the hotel or if there are any hotels in New York City that you recommend to me. Always love to hear your ideas, your suggestions. So, yep, I'll see you soon. Bye!